Okay, I guess it's movie time. I'm going to show you what I'm dealing with in, as far as trying to get these holes just right on the Gerber file. This is the back plate I use for my crossover networks. It's custom made just the way I want it. I designed it and I have it built for me. This is a decal that goes on the back and uh, has little serial numbers peeks through there. Also custom made. Fits right on there like that. This is a uh, so-called speak-on dual connector. It's for an input on a loudspeaker. It'll take two different kinds of connectors, so it's very nifty. It has two pins on here that the signal has to go through. Once you have the connectors and the decal and the serial number and the back plate all assembled, you get this. And there are the pins that I was talking about. And they are where they are and they need to fit through the, the itty bitty holes actually they're fairly large holes on this circuit board which have to be in exactly the right place see so see those little pins sticking through there that's just right so those holes have to be dead on the money I mean they have to be in exactly the right place here's the same board assembled or stuffed if you will and uh, there it is. And it's held on with screws in the four corners, and that uh, is that. That's a very high quality crossover network for a very high quality loudspeaker. And that's why I send them all over the world. And I've been making these things for over 25 years by hand, and I'm really sick of it. So I hope I can get this right. But it d does depend on these holes that line up with these pins being in exactly the right spot. So that's what I'm dealing with. Um, I hadn't had a chance to open up a, you know, those Gerber files that specify where the holes are. You said they could be edited with a text editor, and I haven't had a chance to look at one to see if I can. But I wanted to show you this, just so you understand. And if you can think of an easier way to get it right, I'll take all the help I can get. And you've been plenty, Jordy. You've helped me out a lot, and I appreciate it very much.